Hello everybody, it is Little Pensy here, um, I've actually done something for my layout, which is kind of different than what the, um, thing on the last video showed. I bought a table. Same legs I've had, but, um, yeah, I've decided to kind of do it a little differently. So I'm going to show you all... What I've got done for this new layout, I guess, it's going to be a lot bigger maybe, but we'll see what comes down to it. And here's what the rough layout is looking like. Just a yard area. This is a very small table, but yet this is also not the whole table. There's some wood back there. It was The table was only going to be up to my knees. And I am six foot, like, one. So, it was not going to be a very good thing. But, you know what? It was 180 bucks, and I'm like, hey, you know what? I could still use it. I could just gotta figure some stuff out. So, yeah. This is what the yard's hopefully going to be looking like. This is going to be the curve that goes here and out towards the main area I'm hoping to. I still got... Uh, this is switchback, I guess you could say. I don't know. I forget the name of it. But, um, I'm looking forward to this because I've got all these guys. Especially this one running again. So I'm hoping that. See what that one back there. Got a couple of these guys over here. I got a. Before. I also got some. British stuff, because I did get a British locomotive. I don't know if I showed that yet, but at some point I will do a video on it. Back over here, though, I am going to be doing a couple different things. I don't know. I don't know. I got a bunch of ideas. I got a bunch of stuff on like Amazon and whatnot, kind of waiting to go. But I'm hoping to get this layout a little different. That's the old styrofoam board, which is probably not going to be used ever again because it is old and it is very wonky and looks like that. So this is what's going to maybe be like. I might do this and that with it, but I got that right there. I put these here. I couldn't even move that hand out of the way. I put those there because I think it looks good and I'm going to have an area for them. I might put some cars here to my edge little area for them to actually get moving. La, la, la. Down here, I might add a, um, the engine shed, our small engine shed. I'm gonna have to make that though, but, um, yeah, I'm gonna try to, I gotta get like a little, maybe a little bigger than the buffers right here, um, track, because I kind of, there's still plenty of room, especially like over here, I can add a, a car there, I move that back. And there's just still a ton of room. Especially up here. But I think over here is going to be a little more business. And I think I might actually add the farm here. Add the farm here just for looks. Hmm. And then, yeah. And I'm actually also looking into having this layout as more Heck. Um, but yeah, let me put my phone down real quick so I want to sit. My legs are killing me. So, yeah, I'm hoping to add some signals, uh, delay signals, that's what they were. So, I can have two trains, hopefully. That's kind of what I'm looking for for the layout. Because on the old track, I can only do one. I'm hoping to run two, because if I can run two, I would have a lot more fun with it. Just because the engines that I have, it would make a little more interesting for me, I think. A lot more fun. Um, what else? I also got some passenger cars that, of course, aren't going to fit in the freight yard. But I can always find the um, room to do them somehow. Just got to look for areas to do them in. Gotta do it correctly, this and that. 
do have a couple of tricks I might try to use, especially like this. And this. I don't know if I'll use them, but, um, excuse me. I don't know. Like I said, there's so much to really work on. This is only, um, day two. I didn't record on day one because I was trying to figure out how we're going to lay down the table. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is a rough start of what I'm trying to do. Because I was going to try to do just one circle, but the table is too small for that. And I'm like, yeah, I'll figure it out. For 180 bucks, I could still use the wood pieces. Got some back there. Got this wood right here. This is just one piece. Make sure I don't take it off. I had to glue the table a little bit. The dowel, the dowel. Yeah, the dowels, I believe that's what they're called. Were, um... Not staying in, so I had to make a more permanent way. Pieces like this. There we go. This was actually supposed to be the centerpiece for the original table. But that never happened. I'll just put this back into here. And, um, I, mean, I can still use the wood. They're still fine. Nothing wrong with them. Make sure I don't take anything out. Okay, good. Because I still got. Four legs that are 20 inches. I could still do something with that. I think it'd be interesting to do something with those. Um, yeah, but there's like a lot of things that I'm looking forward to. Hopefully, yeah, I can keep going. Cause I definitely haven't gone to any train stores in a while. That's for sure. Um, but yeah, I'll see what I can make of this, and hopefully, I can. Run some more trains on the layout, new layout, because I don't really have a thought. I did have one for the old one, but of course that went to dump. Uh, out of the yard, over here, I can have a nice little, just center area. I can, because there's a plug right next to me. I don't know, like I might add something behind the caboose area, like a nice little. I'm gonna have to make that automated somewhat. Uh, there's a lot of possibilities to work with this, but I'll see what goes on in life and, and in general. I'll talk to y'all later. Have a good one.